Alrighty then, ladies and gentlemen, tis I, Discord, Lord of Chaos, and after all, the <laughs> long-awaited reaction and analyst of TF2 Analyst, Meet the Red Team, full movie two-year anniversary by Dr. Wolf. <laughs> it's long awaited, but it's finally here. Let's get into it. And as always, if you're new around here, please be sure to drop this video a like. And if you're also new around here, why not subscribe to the channel itself for more analysis and archive videos, like reactions and, and analysis. So without further ado, let's get it. <laughs> this is cool. Hey, look, buddy. I'm a doctor. And that means I solve problems. Not problems like what is quality, because that would fall within the purview of your conundrums of exegesis. I solve people problems. For instance, how am I going to stop some big mean Mother Hubbard from bringing their disproportionate antipathy towards our beloved fandom? <laughs> of course, with turrets and fire, of course. And, of course, second logical analysis. <laughs> oh, wow. I, see what I did there? I think I just fought the wall break. Eh. Who knows? The answer? Use some love. Love. And if that don't work, use tough love. <laughs> Ooh. Like this, the moment with Dr. Wolf series featuring many different analysts. Designed by us. Built by us. Oh, oh. and I'm a brand new analysis. Analyst. An analysis? Science? Uh, I don't know. Analysis. Yes, I'm brand new to the, the analysis community. And you best hope. Probably pointed at you. <laughs> that was cool. Who's next? <gasps> oh, this is going to be f um, fiery. I fear no stallion, but that mare. <laughs> <She> <laughs> Oh yes, you best watch your back. <laughs> I've been able to help so many others in my work, but this darkness in her, it scares me. They really shouldn't have made me angry. No. Oh. Oh my, everything's on fire. Oh, this is gonna be good. Voice of reason. Means a good job, kid. It's hard work. You're indoors. I guarantee it won't be boring. Because at the end of the day, as long as there's media out there, someone's gonna want something critiqued. <laughs> Damn, I'm not an internet troll. I'm a reviewer. Well, the difference being, one's a hobby, the other's sick obsession. I'll be honest with you. My parents do not care for it. I think I made someone angry. Yes, yes, I did. <laughs> That's cool. Analysis. Look, mate. You know who does analysis? Dopes who talk about their flight for majority of the videos. Reviewers. Really, an American doing an Australian accent. Uh, this is going to be one interesting analysis of them doing analysis. So it's really a double, double analysis. Of standards. Be set up. Give constructive criticism to anything that comes your way. <laughs> oh, that was cool. I like that. Oh yes, the demo pony. What 
makes me a good analyst? If I were a bad analyst, I wouldn't be sitting here with 15,000 subscribers, now would I? Let's do this! Taste my German sweetness! One bad argument, one missed funny easter egg, visible in the background for an entire second of an episode, <laughs> one mean word about Fluttershy, and KABOOY! Flame Wars in the comment section! <laughs> I am an actual real German. And they cast me as a demo man instead of <laughs> You wanted to be the medic. <laughs> well you gotta take what you gotta take. The medic. So you think it is a good idea to send a German packed with explosives out into a war zone? We'll see about that. Making me that demo man is like combining the worth from Michael Bay and Overball into one direct 2 DVD summer blockbuster. And you luck will have to review it! <laughs> 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 oh, they are going to have to glue you back together in Tartus! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's cool. Stab, make funny noise. Stab, stab. Oh god, I can only see where this is going. Needing meet the firebrand. <sighs> oh joy. Oh, and by the way, the 85% done of meet the discord. Oh. <laughs> I love it, and I know you guys love it, so that will be linked in the description, as well as Dr. Wolf's channel, and this analysis video, like the TF2 analysis, this movie itself. I will link, I will have everything linked in the description below, don't you worry. When you are a field medic, doing no harm is not the issue. In fact, I always found the best medicine was... preventative. The issue was time, and the time it took to save one patient, a hundred more took their place. Oh yes. I'd almost given up hope. It had been my darkest moment, until inspiration struck. Oh god. I wonder what would happen if I mixed these. Oh. Oh my, Lordy Lou, God damn, my friend, what have you done? Why would you mix two drinks together and then have it catastrophically explode in your face? <coughs> Rock and roll. Kill me. <laughs> Later. Kill me! For goodness sake, kill me! I'm trying! You're invincible! <laughs> Idea. I had to get into the battlefield where it was needed most. I could do in seconds what would take other doctors months. I could take ponies to the peak of hell and beyond. I could make gods. Jesus. So let me see if I remember this correctly. You beheaded a spy. Yep. And you stabbed a pyro. Dead. Then you proceeded to pump their blood into Miss Rose's comatose body. Every drop. Then afterwards you gathered the remains of radioactive soda, German whiskey, and human waste, which you then used to experiment on the dismembered body of the aforementioned spy. Yep, pretty much. The answer is still no. I will not let you put a mega baboon heart in me. Oh, why not? <laughs> a mega. <laughs> uh, uh, first of all, <laughs> oh Jesus! Oh, I swear I'm going to 
be laughing throughout this whole analysis. <laughs> A baboon heart in dock. Oh, Jesus. I don't trust you. Besides your obvious mental instability, you get far too carried away with your rants while operating and forget you're supposed to be operating. Honestly, he was getting on Rarity's case for leading Spike on and playing with his feelings, as if they could ever have a real relationship. For Pete's sake, he's a freaking child. Until he gets past the age of consent, it's never going to happen. Uh, I think you just killed Silver Quill. You know, if you didn't want to listen, you could have just said so. He's dead. He's still alive. What's your point? <sighs> the point is, your operations are unsafe. Oh yes, I'm sure. <laughs> Quotation marks. Alive. You want to rephrase that? I don't want to experience another one. I shudder to think about the last time you operated on me. Oh, speaking of which, I probably accidentally switched the big toe from your right foot with the one on your left. What? Made you look. Ah. <laughs> uh. I like this art style. Gotta say, I like it. Yes. That's oh no. Mm. Oh, meet the ink rose. Hi there, I'm <gasps> ink rose, and I am the best scout you are ever gonna see. Ah, 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 that's cute, ink rose. Ah. You see, I enjoyed the simple things in life, maiming Aussies. <laughs> Blinding soldiers. And drawing pictures of me and Medic Kissin. <laughs> Grass grows, birds fly, sun shines, and sister, I destroy you with my head cannons. And then, as Applejack's parents took their last breaths, the timber wolves tearing at their flesh. Applejack screamed, her eyes filling with... Oh, Jesus. <coughs> Somebody doesn't feel sound right. You know, if you were from where I was from, you would be freaking dead. Well, if you were an earth pony or a unicorn, that is. I mean, I'm from Cloudsdale, and you'd fall from the clouds, so yeah. Uh, <laughs> you'd be dead. Unless you're a unicorn who knows a cloud walking spell or something. Or maybe you're an earth pony with a unicorn friend. Oh, whatever! <laughs> need a dispenser here, 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 need a dispenser here. Nope. So basically, the point is, I'm kind of a big deal. So don't go messing with me, lest you want the business end of my Sandman. <laughs> Just kidding. I'll shoot your freaking brains out. Ooh. See ya! That is one violent Pegasus. Holy crap. Eh, but still. <laughs> Holy shit. Huh. This stuff's kind of good. Make the keyframe. All oh, this is gonna be good. Feeling's a good job, mate. Make your own hours. Always buy a computer. I guarantee you'll never be bored. Cause at the end of the day, as long as there's two people left on the planet, one of them will want an opinion to argue with. <laughs> dad, dad, dad! I am not a hater. I'm a reviewer. But one is a job, and the other is the internet equivalent of sadistic fetishism. I'll be honest, my parents don't subscribe to my channel. I 
think I started a comment <laughs> Oh yes, yes I did. <laughs> oh, this is cool. Strength! You know who has a lot of strength? Those who spend all day making novel sized posts about Oh, really, can you just be so far away from the Australian accent? It's more like, oh, mate. Here, yeah, 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 Dad, Dad, just put Mum on the phone, will you? Oh, just Dad. Really? There, that's how you do an Australian accent. I, being me, from Australia, that's how you do it. So, boom, headshot, mate. <laughs> oh, let's continue. How bad season three was. Your analysis have standards. Be polite, be economical, and have a plan on how to rip apart any episode in your past. <laughs> rip apart? I can't really rip apart anything. Hola, hola. Where am I? And what in the bloody sweet Tartarus are you supposed to be? Well, I'm a sniper, Sheila. <laughs> no. Who are you? I'm the sniper. What? I'm the snipe. Hold on. I'm the sniper. I'm sorry, Miss Frame, but voice was cast as the sniper. Huh? But I got the script in the. Wait a minute. <laughs> and why? That was not funny, A and Y. <laughs> You're right. It was hilarious. <laughs> hey, and why you're such an asshole? <laughs> you know what? You're right, Ay. It was funny. In fact, it was so funny. I want to try a different class. Well, say what? Oh yeah. Pretty tell I'm which class. The Demo Mayor. <laughs> you really want to get between that? Yeah, no. Oh, I think that was a little bit of a glitch. Oh, yes! Meet the Silver Quill. This is going to be cool. Meet the Heavy, an equivalent to what I'm doing. Along with Athila. Big shout out to Athila, thank you. Alert! A friendship has been detected. I am Heavy Weapon Silver Quill, and this is my... <coughs> and this is my weapon. She weighs 150 kilograms, and that would be more impressive if I actually understood the metric system. She fires $200 custom tooled cartridges at 10,000 rounds per minute. It costs $400,000 to fire this weapon for 12 seconds. So, naturally, I have only fired it once. <laughs> oh, fired it right. Once. Aiming. Failure. You're an embarrassment. Some folks <laughs> think they can outreview me. Maybe. But I've yet to meet one that could outrun me. What is it with you and flamethrowers? Who ah! ah, gave you a rocket launcher? <laughs> I don't want any healing! Ah! <laughs> Kill him! Slaughter him like a dog! Uh, I'm gonna go home and cry some more. <laughs> ah, Silver Quill. Here are your weapons, guy. Next time, try killing one of them. Oh, bite me, you squawk box. 
This is gonna be fun. <laughs> Men, these are the facts as I Ah, uh, I am going to love this series. I even love it today. Even if it came out like 24th of November 2016, 17, 18, 19, so like three years ago, I still love this. Even today. Well done to you, team. I gotta say, this is amazing. And thank you for vibrating, phone. Ugh. Understand them. One, I am the prettiest unicorn. Two, my mane is lustrous and fragrant and catches the wind perfectly. Therefore, I am going to trot into the forest and pick each and every one of you maggots an arrangement of flowers, and they will be lovely. Am I making myself clear? I love Roger. No. Is he always like this? You get used to it, just smile and nod. Let's get one thing straight. You are all pretty unicorns. I find that highly offensive. But I <laughs> am the prettiest unicorn. Did I stutter? I am the prettiest unicorn. My mane smells like lavender and my horn grants wishes. Is that understood, man? Um, not really understood, but your horn is... Let's just say... A toilet roll. <laughs> Begins in 60 seconds. Get to an upgrade station and prepare for the next wave. Ugh, finally! <laughs> oh, very funny, guys. Brand, why are you healing me? Uh, strategy. The more I heal someone, the slower they get healed. So if I heal someone who doesn't need it at the start and build my Uber that way, I can keep the healing at maximum efficiency longer. Well, okay. <laughs> ha -ta! That is adorable. Huh? <laughs> Princess Molestia's faithful student. Ah! Oh my gosh, that bugs me too when other people do that. I so need to cover them up with my own sprays now. <laughs> Mission begins in 20 seconds. Five. <laughs> four. Three. <laughs> two. One. I mean, this series is absolutely badass. I love every aspect of it. <laughs> this is simply amazing. Oh, and by the way, guys, I have an announcement I would like to make, but that's for another video. Let's continue. <laughs> Was that supposed to be an Australian accent? Metal Giant! No, that is the fat man's line. What you say is... No, I mean Metal Giant! Oh man, look at Firebrand. He just hasn't the necessary level of Germanness. You got an actual German yeah, No, they said. Too cliche, they said. <laughs> Note to self. Schedule another session with Ellie. I can feel my limbs, but this is awesome. Yo, give me some heels, Doc. Uh, sure, yes, yes ma'am. Right away, ma'am. Thank you. Aw. Uh, hey, doctor. What do you think of Amy? Miss Rose? I think she's a sweet girl. Very energetic, very friendly, and she came up with quite a few intriguing ideas about MLP in our latest project. Why do you ask? Um, what do you think about her lab? I beg your pardon? 
I don't know. Don't you think she has a nice laugh? Ah, oh, the shipping's delicious. <laughs> I suppose. Gotcha! <laughs> Are you feeling all right, Firebrand? I am charged! Mr. Firebrand? <laughs> Could there be something going on here that you're not telling me? Do you require healing? I have a dispenser. Oh. <laughs> Carry on. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know, but I've been told I'm a pretty unicorn. Huh? <laughs> Whoa! Ah! Get your colossal bird butt off of me! My plot is nicely proportioned and of pony origin, thank you. Shut up! Well, what do you know? Out of ammo, I should probably get some. <laughs> <laughs> that's some shonky business right there. Oh, 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 man, that's gotta hurt. A bite in the ear, really? Oh, oh, no, no, Ellie, don't put Phantom in the oven. Let me put any stuffing in it. Oh, <laughs> wow, either Phantom must be really flexible or. Oh, my. Oh. Hey, Brand! <gasps> uh, yes, Ink? The Madam Milk icon says this is a non milk substance. If it's not milk, then what is it? <laughs> uh, soy. It's soy. I can see why A and Y is laughing. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just say some really NSFW stuff. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I get it now. That's why it gives you health. Thanks, Brand. Nicely handled, my Brand. Hey. Hello, wounded warrior over here. Mr. Firebrand? Ah, no, I don't think he's cute! <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Firebrand, <laughs> let me tell you right now that you're going to have to work on being a little more honest. If you keep trying to deny yes. these feelings to others and yourself... Ah! Holy shit. Is this really the best time to try and psychoanalyze me, Doc? It's getting dark. No, wait. I had my eyes closed. Is this really the best time to get into a stupor every time ink runs... I love Silver Quill. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> He's just the best, I reckon. Eh. Past, either we need to focus on the fight at hand, or I need to help you get a better handle on your feelings. Which is it going to be, Mr. Firebrand? You tell him, Doc. Uh, point taken, we'll talk later. Good man. Stop! Hmm. You know, this could be the head cavity talking, but I'd ship it. Ow! Fudge nuggets! Ink, do you please get those snipers? Okay, since you said the P word. Aww. Come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> oh, shit. Look out! Surprise! Oh, man, I was so aiming for that giant. Oh, well. Whee! Aww. Whoosh. Are you unharmed, Firebrand? Mostly. Mostly? Yeah, I think Cupid might have shot me real good there. Yep, he definitely shot me because I just said the most horribly sappy thing I've ever said in my entire life. Ah. <laughs> well then, my advice would be to not put things off for too long. Mm, would you be willing to find the time to just go talk to her after this is over? Not let things stew until you start having more awkward moments in the middle of the battlefield? You know, you're lucky I don't take genuine questions about my well-being as insulting subtext. And I'm glad to see that you can keep calm even when discussing something personal. Well completed. Well done. Woohoo! Now's as good a time as any, Firebrand. You have an opportunity before the next wave starts. Yep. Okay, we'll do it. Oh, uh, any last-minute tips before I potentially destroy the friend thing Ink and I have going on? I'm more of the court jester than Prince Charming, you know. I think I could recommend that you focus on what you like about her in regards to who she is more than what she is. When you're hmm. searching for a compliment, try talking about her personality or her virtues, rather than any physical traits. 
But most of all, I think you should follow the very simple advice of a big blue genie. But remember, <laughs> be yourself. <laughs> hey, bad reference jokes are my thing. Well then, you must be rubbing off on me. Now stop with the self-deprecating humor and go talk to her before the round starts back up. Okie dokie, artichokey. Wish me luck. <laughs> It's good to be healthy. I am the prettiest unicorn! Oh, they got Phantom Horn. Don't He's dead! I never liked him anyway. <laughs> oh, get Next. Him. Yep. Up the wall. And why? Eliora. Firebrand. Give and take. And crows. Phantom Horn. Silver Quill. Voice of Reason. What a series banger. I love this TF2 Analysts. <laughs> I'm sure it is. Oh, here comes Lightning Bliss. So, you want to be on the team, huh? Well, you know, I just saw that there might be a chance, and I just want to be on the team. Hmm. I would hesitate to have you be part of this team unless you were able to show great mental fortitude in a hectic situation. I hate your main. Reject it. Uh... <laughs> Cognizance, it's everywhere! Well, that was petty of you. Hey, I heard a Wilhelm scream. What's going on? Uh, we're holding auditions for Ooh, the... Golden Fox. ...recently opened soldier position on our team. Recently opened? What happened to Phantom Horn? Well, oh. we felt it was his time to be let go. That his life's going in a different direction. That his... Body's part of a permanent outplacement program. He died. You have no. <laughs> Just straight up, he died. <laughs> uh, oh my, Celestia, he just died. Sense of tact. Cry some more. So, bird butt, you think you want in? Yeah, no. I can't imagine anyone who would want to be a soldier after hearing that. Hey, are you guys still holding auditions? Whoa, you're not auditioning for the soldier role, are you? No, well, I'm auditioning for sentry number three. Yes, I'm auditioning for the soldier. No sarcasm, dear. Why are you so against this? I fit the role like a velvet glove. Violent, angry, fiery, joking. What? Hey! Honestly, this was meant for me! Because I think it's masochistic to play this role. Oh, so now it's bad to be masochistic. Um, could we get the two of you to talk about this elsewhere? Like, yes. perhaps my office tomorrow? Yeah, this has been happening more frequently. We'll set up an appointment ASAP. Huh? But, but wait, wait, hon, we could talk about this! Hon! <laughs> <laughs> Lovers, am I right? Not dignifying that. No, you can never dignify that with a response. After your actions towards, <clears throat> well, Incros, and how you are, think she's cute and <laughs> how cute and quaint. Hey, Mary Sue, Ma Mary Sue, listen, you really need to work on that teleportation spell of yours. <sighs> yes, here comes the mad monk, munchkin. Love it to death as a brony reviewer and an artist. <laughs> You've overshot it again. You 
to be in the middle of what looks like a set for some sort of lame Joel Schumacher movie. Yeah, well, you were supposed to teleport me to Universal Studios. Excuse me? Are you here for the audition? What do you mean they're the same thing? Hello, hello. My name is Argent Featherpen. I hear you are seeking a soldier for your lovely team. And I would like to play the part. Seriously, Silver? Come on, we know that's you. Besides, being the heavy isn't that bad. Attention, maggots! I am here to be your new soldier, which is a good deal better than me that meat shield of a heavy. And I... Oh my, nondescript deities. You are the smexiest thing I have ever beheld. Ooh, back at you, big boy. <laughs> the smexiest thing. Oh my. Nope, I don't ship it. More importantly, why are there two of them? Is this another mirror pool incident, or one of them a changeling? Either way, it might be dangerous. Either way, we should shoot them both and sort it out later. Oh my, I never agreed to any violence. I just thought I'd look fabulous in that helmet. You call that a firearm? I call that cold outside. <laughs> Innuendo. Ow, what the bloody... Oh no. Try and catch it, Maddie. Um, you guys better run. She's going to exact revenge and everything else on your ass. And yeah. Oh, snap. Great idea! <laughs> ah, chaos. Beautiful, isn't it? Oh, man, look, look, see what that stupid pink alicorn made me do. You're hired. Wait, what? Are you joking with this? After all this mess I made? If by mess you mean masterpiece, then absolutely. Wait, that's not a word. Plus, you've shown great capability for destruction, while at the same time leaving the people who ensured your position completely untouched. That shows either a subliminal sense of self-control or an unprecedented amount of luck, both of which would be a valuable asset to the team. Also, oh, you destroyed the entire audition room. We kind of have no choice but to go with you. Hey guys, what do you do? Okay, right. See you tomorrow. Walking away very fast! Well, if it means I've had the chance to introduce a little anarchy causing indiscriminate chaos and destruction while we'll be absolutely nothing more to do. Yes, chaos, anarchy, and destruction. Oh, ho, 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 ho. my favorite type. <laughs> do we have, um, happy to be of service? Duh. That was cool. Alright. That was well put together. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Oh, <laughs> TF2 analysts. Meet the red team. Next up is meet the blue team, but that video, that video will come out later. I hope you enjoyed, and as always, chaos is magic. Bye.